Hello everybody out there. Hey everybody, Hikes with Mike here. I want to go over the mental aspects of the trail today. Um, there's a lot of issues that you'll have on the trail and depending on who you are you'll have more or less me I have more so this is a big issue for me um, I have a family at home that once I get out of the trail I miss them pretty bad and not everybody's gonna have that problem but if you do have kids and a family at home um, I would suggest some of these things for you. Um, I would suggest writing a list of the reasons why you want to be on the trail. At least 10 of them. I wrote 10 and I'll read them to you real quick. The 10 reasons I want to be a through hiker. One, to redefine who I am as a man and a father. Um, two, reconnect with my childhood. I grew up on a 45-acre ranch in Oregon, and I was outside pretty much all the time, and very similar to how living on the trail is, and so that's how I reconnect with my childhood. Um, I want to live deliberately. I want to be out there on purpose. I want to be out testing my skills on purpose. I want to be out uh, hiking 20 miles a day on purpose. Uh, I want to test my survival skills. Um, I grew up as a Boy Scout and and haven't really tested those skills or or honed in those skills um, in a while, and so I want to do that again. Um, I want to find adventure where it lives. So I don't want an adventure to come to me unexpectedly. I want to go out and find my own adventure. And out on that trail, there's enough of adventure for all of us. And so I want to go find that. I want to be more accountable. Like my last video, I said that I wasn't quite ready on my through hike last year and uh, got myself in more than one bad situation. And so I've been studying and practicing and really trying to hone in my skills and have been becoming more accountable for myself, my gear, and my trip and my hike. I want to create something beautiful. So I'm practicing on how to talk to you guys, how to be comfortable on the, in front of the camera so that I can create something for you guys that you might actually want to watch. Um, and it's harder than it looks. I want to show my kids how to chase their dreams. This has been my dream for the past year and a half. And I've done everything I can to try to prepare myself. And I've done it right in front of my kids in, in hopes that someday that they'll chase their dreams as well. I want to meet like-minded people. Um, when I went out on the trail, I met a community of people that I wasn't really expecting and it really blew me away on how caring and loving the people really are on the trail. And so I look forward to that again. And I, the last one is I want to prove to myself that I can do it. I did write to prove the haters wrong, but there's gonna be some haters, and you can't really prove them wrong. You don't have to prove them wrong, because sometimes when somebody hates on you, they're actually only hating because they don't like, they're worried that you're gonna do something wrong that might put yourself in a dangerous situation. And I encourage that all you want, and um, I'll take it with a grain of salt, and I'm gonna do what I wanna do, but, um, that's how that goes. Um, also, uh, I am gonna have a recording of my wife uh, on my phone, um, encouraging me to hike on and 
when I don't have cell phone service and I need an encouraging word from her, I'll be able to click on that and, and hear her encouraging words. Um, make small goals, make small hiking goals, make small goals that you can reach during your hike. Uh, if your hike, if your goal is to go five days uh, camping in your tent, make that goal. I would suggest doing that goal before you get out on a trail, but if you don't, that's fine too. Uh, and just get used to everything and get used to the trail and what the trail has to offer. And uh, the last one would be, be prepared. Uh, there's more than one aspect to the trail and it requires you to practice all of those. So be prepared to do big miles, be prepared to sleep out in the cold, be, pre be prepared to not talk to anybody for several days, um, and be prepared to be uncomfortable. And so you have to practice all those things. And on top of that, if you want to YouTube, you have to practice YouTubing too. So um, anybody that's out there preparing for a through hike, um, I hopefully you guys are hustling and bustling like I am and doing everything you can to get prepared for the trail. All right, till next time, hike on.